Well, they had a response of some members that say, look, what's with the hue and cry? If, if he's away, the deputy is acting. And so, in fact, some even saying that, I mean, what if he's back now and you're not aware? Well, uh, on the issue of being back, I want to tell you that the Enugu Papers Assembly, uh, we are the first group. If you go to some newspaper of 4th of November, we declared a three days fasting and a prayer for, for the governor of Enugu State, Mr. Barrister Sullivan, Ihana Churchill. That is, even before any other group came on board, we were the first group of people that said, look, our governor is sick. Let us go to God, pray to him, just like it is being done in other places in the world where you practice real democracy like in Venezuela, we're all conversant with what is happening there. We've been actually been praying for him. Nobody is saying, we're all mortars. Anybody can get sick anytime. So the issue of the governor getting sick has never been an issue with the people of Enugu State. And again, as I said, his absence has actually stalled development in Enugu State. Starting from legislation, for the past five months, there has never been any bill assented to. Have they been the sitting? Well, that's another big question because sometimes last year they all went on a jamboree trip to the United States. Sorry. All the 24 members of the House of Are you saying they've not been sitting well, ever since then? Even if they have been sitting, it's like they are not sitting because no, nothing has ever come out of, of their city. But have they been sitting? Yes, partially, yes, they have been sitting. And even if they've not been sitting, I mean, how does that, how is it a problem of the executive arm of government? Well, the duties of the legislatures are is to make laws for the land. And those laws become effective only when it is being assented to by the executive. But now that you say they've been sitting, uh, I mean, some other people there say, look, if the deputy governor is there, he's supposed to act, there shouldn't be any problem about all that is going on. But from your perspective, what exactly are you now asking? What we are asking, first and foremost, if our governor is back, we say a big way come back to our big brother, to our good governor. If he is not back, we are asking the people on the corridors of power in Enugu State to do that which is right, which is to allow the deputy governor not only to act, but to be active. Because right now, as I talk to you, I repeat, nothing is happening in Enugu State. If anybody has a contrary view, let him come here. I'm ready to meet him any day, any time. There is no road construction going on in Enugu State. There is no new structures. Even the old secretary they brought down are telling you nothing is happening there. It has not been done even 20%. So what would you say uh, if after all of this, because uh, in, in the new space, uh, you know, after the picture appeared, which you say uh, wasn't real, yeah. uh, and the news, even as it's early this morning, has it that the governor will arrive today? For some others, they say he's already in the country. Yes. What would you say when finally he comes back? And what would you say about the picture, which you never believed it? Well, the picture I have, I have a son newspaper here. You can see where it is written, courtesy of Enugu House of here. Courtesy Enugu Government House. So it's not my own making. They supplied this picture. Yeah, so does that so, invalidate the picture? Because, of course because they supplied it. No, 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 no. That is not the issue. Okay, we're there part of the group that made the trip to London along with the governor's forum representative. So you're saying that this picture is not real? It's not real, yes. On yes. what grounds do you I say have just told you why it is not real. Because the state government people has supplied went, it. Yes, and the people went now and said when they went for economic summit in Geneva in 2011, that was when this picture was taken. But you know you do you also doubt, sorry Chamberlain, do you yeah. also doubt the statement of the governor of Anambra State who said he spoke with the governor and his deputy oh. on the Amansi no, issue? No, 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 not at all. But again, after he said he spoke with them, with them, he didn't tell you exactly what our good governor said. Even the, even the governor's forum representatives, when they came back, did they tell anybody what they discussed with Chime, or Governor Chime, what was his response? The body language is there shows contrary that all is not well. 